Hey, now, listen. Last week, we went to uh, Botswana. Uh, I, hope you, uh, I hope you saw it. And the idea of the story was that we were saying you don't need a four-wheel drive car to drive off-road, and you'd be amazed how long an old car can be kept going, even when you think it's dead. Unfortunately, it became um, really a love story. Um, it was the story, really, of a young man who went out there <laughs> to Africa, and he... Hang on a minute. What? Because I think we can improve this with an old Top Gear prop. Hold on. What old Top Gear prop? Just hang on, I'll find it. You well, you're an old Top Gear prop, how can you? I know that. No, honestly, this will improve it immensely. I'll start again. Would you? Yeah, hang on. Yeah. Wait, wait for it, right. OK. So, it's the story, really, of a young chap... <laughs> ..who went to Africa <laughs> and fell in love with a, with a 43-year-old Opal cadet who he called Oliver. <laughs> and they would sit for many hours under the stars telling each other they had eyes like pools of moonlight. And now he's decided to ship him back. I've said Hang him. On. Eat. Ship eat back to England, haven't yeah. you? Yeah, I have. He's coming home. Are you going to live in the country together and, you know, like embroider church kneelers? Are you sure this isn't just, you know, the typical holiday romance? You'll get him home. <laughs> <laughs> when you were out there, you thought you had a lovely moustache. You'll get him home and he'll be horrid. Richard, he only wants a British passport. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> MOT. Listen, it's real. He loves me and he's coming home. That's a fact. It just is out. I'm Don't... going to be sick. <laughs> Look at him. There he is. There. <laughs> Missing him. He's on a boat right now as we speak. I know. No, you're not offloading. Bristol. <laughs> mm. I don't know when. Oh, <laughs>